how to make $500 a week buying fiber gigs we've all heard that you could sell your services on fiber but how in the world are you gonna make money by buying gigs well let me tell you how I'm gonna show you in this video how you can actually make $500 a week a thousand dollars a week or even more by buying gigs on Fiverr and we're getting started right now hey thanks for showing up today I want to help you make some money and if you stay to the end of this video you're gonna find out that actually buying some of the services on these websites can actually make you money it actually can happen and I actually want to walk you through it step by step don't forget to subscribe to the channel don't forget to ring the bell turn on all bell notifications that way I can let you know every single time I do a video give me a thumbs up because it does help the YouTube algorithm now let's jump into this we initially think well Fiverr that's a place that you go to you know sell your services to do a job but the thing is you know you're, you're selling your services for five ten bucks or ten bucks or twenty bucks whatever it is you can't make any real money doing that what you want to do is you want to make real money and the way to make real money is invest in assets so we can actually go to Fiverr and buy assets we can actually hire somebody on Fiverr to write an article or make a video on promoting maybe an affiliate offer maybe we found an affiliate offer that's really good and we're gonna hire somebody else to actually make a video or write a blog or write an article on that particular product that way we can send some traffic to that product and make us some money when that article ranks maybe that can make you fifty dollars or maybe it could make you five hundred dollars or a thousand dollars for that one article now these articles don't cost that much so what I'd like to do is go over to Fiverr right now kind of check out the people that are there and how much they charge to do some of these articles and some of these things and let's get going right now okay as you can see I'm at Fiverr right now and what I want to do is I want to look in here for people who can do things for me so let's say I wanted an affiliate video made so I'm just gonna put an affiliate video now if we scroll down here it says here I will give you a super affiliate system course we don't want that they're trying to sell us something uh, I will do a twitch video channel promotion to boost no we don't want that Let's see, we got to scroll through all right here we go I will create a promotional video for your affiliate offers now let's click on this and let's see what this costs now, I don't know how much your time is worth I know how much mine is worth I think it's very very important um, but I know that writing you know articles and blogs and doing videos um, is not something I want to do on a regular basis okay that takes up way too much of my time okay so I've clicked on this particular one here and let's see here it says that they'll do a 30 second high converting video to promote your product or service for $15 I mean $15 I don't know what your time's worth but I'm not gonna make a video for $15 for anybody now if they've got other packages down here let's click and look at the other packages $15 gives you a 30 second one uh, and then what else does it give you here Two uh, gives you one revision you get two revisions at $35 and at $50 the premium you get three revisions and you can get 60 seconds on here so think about this guys I could buy this one video here for 50 bucks and be promoting a thousand dollar offer or five hundred dollar offer if I get one or two sales it's more than paid for now what if I did this what if I did this five times and I had five different ones what if I did it ten times or a hundred times do you see how buying these services on here of people who could do it a lot quicker probably a lot better than I can can actually make you money if you're just doing affiliate offers what I'm gonna suggest you do is not what most people do is they make some money online and then they spend it I'm not I'm not gonna tell you to do that I'm gonna tell you to make some money online and invest it in the next thing um, I know at this point in my life I've, I've made a lot of money online we've sold millions of dollars of both digital and physical products but I'm still learning I'm still learning so I take a portion of my money and I buy courses and I learn things uh, and I go to you know meetings when we could leave and it's not a pandemic you know and I get around other people and I talk to them um, so I would say take a portion of your money and do another video in another video okay or another blog and another article take the money you make and invest it into more assets instead of just spending it don't go out and buy a whole new you know, living room suit or more clothes or whatever those things are gonna wear out and they don't earn you any money 
you need to start taking a portion of your money and putting it in something that's going to earn you money um, right now there's a couple advertising things i want to know about and i'm probably going to buy a course on that and start learning that because that's important to me to have that knowledge to be able to do that and you know what the funny thing is a lot of these courses i've bought and i've learned how to do things i now have courses on those things so once i learn how to do it then i can actually make a course of my own and sell it um, because i've done it um, the next thing I'm going to tell you is to do some marketing promotions. Okay. Um, have people help you with marketing promotions. Now I'm going to tell you most emphatically do not buy traffic. Okay. Do not buy clicks to your site. Do not buy traffic to your site. Do not buy likes on your YouTube channel. Don't buy subscribe. Don't buy anything like that. It's crazy. Okay. You're not going to make any money. You're going to get ripped off. Those are all bots. It doesn't work. However, there is real marketing promotion. So let's go back over to Fiverr real quick. See if we can find a marketing promotion. Okay. So I'm going to go back up to the top here and I'm going to search product promotion. Okay. Product promotion. Uh, let's see here. I will promote and market your e-commerce store to the U S uh, I don't know what that is, but she's got a 4.8. Let's take a look here and see what she does. And it says here, um, 29 day delivery, basic store promotion. Uh, and I would have to read all this, uh, five bucks seems really cheap, but I will say she's got 640, uh, reviews, uh, and 567 or five stars. So she's doing something right. Uh, and you have to read through here. It says here, I'm going to upsize this, uh, receive tons of traffic to my site. I may have to purchase the higher package for sales. But all in all i will be purchasing again i want to make sure somebody got uh this person here did not rate her well i want to make sure somebody got some real results thank you did a good job uh quality thanks again so you know you got to read through them all but paying somebody to do some promotions for you can save you a tremendous amount of time and effort uh, and for the little amount of money and don't try to be cheap. Don't try to do everything for $5. Okay. Spend 10, 20, 30, 50, maybe even hundred bucks and get somebody really good. Just check out the ratings before you do that. But buying those promotions can really make you a lot of money. Now I will add something to this. Um, that one person said they hadn't gotten any sales yet, but they were trying to, if you do get real traffic from a promotion from somebody who's legit. Uh, somebody on Fiverr like that. And I'm not saying everybody on Fiverr is legit, but I'm saying find somebody that is look at the reviews, check them out. And if they're legit and they send you a lot of traffic, but you don't get any sales, that doesn't mean you've lost out. It doesn't mean you've lost out because what that's done is it's generated traffic to your site. That looks good for the Google search algorithm. Uh, it's going to build your SEO up. It's going to do a lot of things for you in the background that you may benefit from later on in the future. So don't don't get discouraged if you don't get immediate sales uh, it's nice to do that it's nice to get immediate sales but understand that sometimes promotions bring brand awareness and maybe a month down the road you know two months down the road six months down through the road somebody's going to buy from you so don't think if you don't get immediate sales that it's wasted because it's not now the next thing I, I think is really pretty cool is to hire people to turn your videos into articles uh, and blogs okay so you could do this you can hire somebody over there and i i hire people to do different things i have several people that do different things for us in different capacities when you hire people to turn your videos into audios or articles or blogs that's going to help your seo also so you have to think of this as, as an investment i know a lot of new business owners they, they go two routes okay the first route is i don't want to spend any money on anything i'm going to do every single thing myself 100% myself and they find themselves doing data entry and all kinds of other things that would pay minimum wage or less that they could hire in another country for a whole lot less money, but they want to save their money. They don't want to spend any money. Uh, and then on the other end of the spectrum, it's somebody who has a lot of money and this, I think this is almost even worse and they hire people to do everything, everything. Okay. And they don't want to do any work themselves. And when you do that, you don't learn anything. You can't manage it because you don't understand it. You can't manage what you don't know. I and mean, that's just a fact. You can't manage what you don't know. So somewhere in between is the happy medium. And I think using a site like Fiverr for people to do things for you, videos, blogs, articles, whatever it is, you know, some maintenance on your website, sales pages, if they're good at it, it's going to come back to you. So actually buying these jobs on Fiverr will actually make you money as crazy as that sounds. And the last thing I'll tell you is know what you're good at. 
I mean, know what you're good at, you know, certain things I'm really good at, and I know I'm good at those things. And it's probably because I like those things. Usually when I'm doing something I don't like doing, and I'm not good at, I get frustrated. Okay. I get really frustrated and that frustration leads me to not doing a good job. So if you're not good at something, um, you know, I, I can edit my videos. I have a video editor. Matter of fact, what's going on there, Billy, he's going to edit this video right here but the bottom line is he's better at that than me because i i don't want to do it i just don't want to do it i don't have the time for it i know i could spend more time making videos coming up with ideas coming up with sales pages coming up with products than to just sit there and edit videos all day long so i hire somebody to do that provides an income for somebody else and you need to share the wealth guys and you need to pay these people decent don't always try to get the cheapest people because if you get the cheapest people you're gonna get the worst people okay bottom line is hire some people buy some jobs off fiverr and you'll end up making money and you know 500 dollars a day or a week is nothing nothing when you invest in yourself thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget if you haven't subscribed already do so hit that subscribe button i want to hear your comments have you hired anybody on fiverr have you done any work on fiverr I want to hear your experience with that. Put that in the comments below. I would really appreciate hearing about that. If you're having issues, you're having problems, put them in the comments below. I'll be happy to answer you. Don't forget to also, oh, that's a bad bell ring. Don't forget to ring the bell and turn on all bell notifications so that I can let you know every time I do one of these videos. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Hey, thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell right there so you can be notified every time I do a new video. Also, click on one of those videos there. Keep watching on my channel.